Hello and welcome to another Geek Roll Order video. Randy here with another toy review. And today we are took, taking a look at Transformers Titans Return Skull Smasher. And this is an update of the original G1 Skull Cruncher figure. Uh, the character originally came about in the season four, uh, only featured in the Rebirth trilogy. And he transforms into a pretty mean looking alligator. I mean, although look at the figure, there is some very nice detail. Just start to take a look at the head. Open up the mouth. Got a nice detail on that tongue there. Um, the head itself is actually on a ball joint, so it can swivel pretty good. But it's got detail. Opens and closes. Nice terrifying look there. It's got all sorts of articulation throughout there. There's the, the claws. The feet. Get, that's about all you get for the legs. And the tail has, it can, yeah. It can come off. That's what it can do. Of course. Ah, of course. It's going to completely come apart while I'm trying to review it. But there's the robot, the alligator mode. All right. Yeah, that's why it's not going down. There you go. But yeah, there's the alligator mode. Very nice detail. It's gonna get a nice look at that. The detail on the claws there and there. Another look at the face. A very nice look in the face. But yeah, let's go ahead and uh, get him into the robot mode here. Yeah, we're just going to start with the tail, because that's the part that... And this tail does a couple of things. Got a, a peg here, and can actually become a weapon. Or become a weapon this way, with another handle. Can become two weapons, actually. Because there is a gun in there. But we'll take a look at that in a minute here. So, there's a little plastic flap, dump the headmaster, and there is the headmaster partner, and then he just folds over like so, and becomes the head. But there is some very nice detail on the head, there it is, but close the flap back up for the legs. Pull, rotate the legs around like that. Um, on the legs, there's a. Where is? There it is. There's a little tab right there. Goes into a little tab on the legs. So they just fold up like that, like that. And the feet, just a little flap right there that comes out on those. Same thing over there. Bring this up as he's getting a little bit taller. And then what you want to do is actually just take this whole thing right here, pull it back. It's just connected to what will become the arms and fold that over. So the head folds over nicely. The alligator head. You just want to pull the arms down like that. You spin those around like that. The claws, they go back like that. And then the hands just fold out. Okay, that's just detail. And then the Head just goes in there like that. And there is Skull Smasher in his robot mode. I'm going to pull that down a little bit. But nice molded detail in the robot. But yeah, the legs are a little hollow. So, a little hard. Oh, there we go. Them a little bit. 
I'm just, yeah, you almost have to put them a little forward to get them to stand properly. He's got a gun. He's got that gun. That gun. And he's got the tail can become a weapon like that. Or you can pull that down. And just put that there. Yeah, right there. So that becomes kind of a weapon thing right there. Or you can make it a mega weapon. Just hold right there. Put the gun up. And so he has one complete weapon like that. I like this. I like this as a weapon. It's kind of a big, beefy weapon. Plus, as you can see, the hand is guarded. So it's going to take a lot to pull that out of his hand. So I actually like that as a weapon. But yeah, there it is. Skull Smasher. And... Yeah, okay. Eh, there he is in his robot mode and there he, okay there you go yeah actually got to get him a little wide stance for him to stand properly but I'll just do a quick little zoom and pan up there but there he is but he's got some nice detail in the robot mode I like the the zany 80s color scheme paint but yeah there is skull smasher in his robot mode and I like this toy. But yeah, uh, for Randy, this has been a Geek World Auditorial Review. See you next time.